so sick of you dumping in the D. And I'll tell you what, I'm coming to your door. Hey, how you doing, cousin? It's Reggie Reg, and I am sitting here with the young man who deserves a big round of applause, but because I'm like holding cameras and stuff like that, I can't really do it, so I'll just snap my fingers. Ah, nah, nah, nah. Everybody make some noise for Mr. Jonathan Palmerville. All right. Jonathan Palmerville is the man, and I'll just let you know, this guy is from the community of Brightmoor. Everybody, you know Brightmoor. Every time you hear the name Brightmoor, oh, yeah, oh, Brightmoor. Destitute. It's just going on legal dumping, prostitution. Da -da -da -da. Let me tell you about this guy. Humpers and dumpers get out of the way. And you Jonathan Palmerville, why do I say humpers and dumpers get out of the way? What do I mean by that? Well, if you come into my neighborhood picking up hookers or dumping off your trash, you're going on YouTube. Really? So you're, you're saying that if I'm one of those companies in the outskirts of Detroit, that is a true story, and I own a, I don't know, car company, furniture company, whatever, and instead of taking my waste to the dump site where it needs to go you know, legally, I say, you know what, I'm going to go over to Brightmore. There's nobody there. There's no houses are burnt down. There's no, it's just, it's just plain everything. Nothing's going. I'm going to go in at 3 in the morning and kick my stuff out of my truck on into the community of Brightmoor. So if I do this, you're gonna be standing there with your camera and you're gonna capture what I'm doing and, and bust me? Uh, not necessarily. Uh, usually what we end up doing is catching you after the fact because uh, a lot of these folks aren't realizing when they're doing this, they're really sending all of their information for me to track them down. And uh, I'm gonna track you down if you're dumping in my neighborhood. Yeah, so let's talk about Jonathan. And you kind of know this story just as, as well as I do. The city of Detroit, uh, we're working with uh, Mayor Mike Duggan. Of course, I'm deputy uh, uh, district manager for uh, District 1 Northwest Detroit. Yeah. And the mayor talks about this, the stuff that you're doing, how we can help with it. Um, we're putting up, uh, we're talking about putting up hidden cameras so that we can spot these guys and get their license plates. I'm, I'm not talking about just cameras that you can't see. Th these cameras are so, so, so viable that uh, they can capture license plates clearly at, at, at night. So I know this is something that's going to help you. That would be a benefit to our neighborhood and, and neighborhoods across the uh, Detroit area. Yeah. We definitely need that. Absolutely. And uh, also you talk about when you say humpers and dumpers, let's talk about the humpers part. <laughs> what, what do you mean by humpers, well, we, we get Jonathan a, Palmerville? We get a lot of guys that uh, that are coming into our neighborhoods and picking up these girls that uh, that are out there hustling their booties out on the street. And uh, <laughs> it's just one of those things. Are you serious, man? That, well, you, you know... It, it's a scourge to our neighborhoods because they're doing this openly in front of our houses. They're throwing their condoms on our front lawns. And we're just, we're tired of it as a community. And we're going to go ahead and we're going to address that. When we see you, um, we're going to come out with our cameras. We're going to address that situation. Jonathan Palmerville, tell us a, a story real quick about you busting one of the, the humper guys. <laughs> uh, one of the first ones that we did, I was sitting out on my porch. There was actually three inches of snow, but it was warm day like today. So it was melting like crazy. This guy comes pulls up in front of our house and and by the time I got to him with my camera uh, you could see everything that was going on inside that vehicle and uh, it, I put him out there on my YouTube site and that's where you know I can't really get um, anything happen with the the police or anything but I can sh certainly shame you on my YouTube site <laughs> <laughs> no, one time Jonathan Palmerville to uh, those that are watching right now, and uh, they pretty much say to themselves and to their their you know people that work around them every day, hey, um, Brightmoor is dump city. What do you have to say to, to catch that to identify Brightmoor, the community of Brightmoor, as dump city? It makes us mad. I'll tell you what, we're not going to take it anymore. We're going to come to your door um, if you get caught dumping in the D. Loving it. Now we want to get in touch with. Uh, and you, we want to see your work. How do we find you, buddy? Uh, you can hit you can hit us up at uh, Brightmoor um, Blight Fighters. Uh, actually, it's called Falknut Blight Fighters. And you can also go to my YouTube site at uh, Falknut.com. How do you spell, spell Falknut? F-O-C-H-N-U-T. That's Falknut.com or CameraCrusader.com. Whoa, my <laughs> man, Jonathan Palmerville. We really appreciate you, man, and I wish there could be like 5,000 more of you all around, not only the city of Detroit, but uh, all over southeast Michigan, man, because you, you're awesome, man. We need you. Yeah, yeah you know, I, I hope more people get inspired to do what we're doing in our neighborhood. It's not just me. It's a 
community of people coming together to make this happen. So um, if you want if you want to get involved, come contact me. You can uh, you can contact me through Facebook, and let's let's go ahead and make that difference together. Hey, Jonathan Palmerville, before you get up out of here, I got a real tough, real hard question for you, man. I hope you went to school or, or at least went to fifth grade because this is really tough. Are you prepared for this tough question I'm getting ready to ask you? Uh, I think so. <laughs> All right, here we go. Jonathan Palmerville, what station are you bouncing with? 105.1, The Bounce. Yeah, baby! <laughs> Did y'all hear that one more time? Jonathan Palmerville, who you bouncing with? 105.1, The Bounce. Yeah. And I just want to add, too, if we can, uh, if you're a resident in the city of Detroit and you want to dump off your trash, you can do it for free at the uh, at the stations across Detroit. So please, please um, keep that in mind when you have contractors that are coming to clean up your mess. Um, a lot of times it's contractors that are dumping over in our streets and and uh, in city of Detroit residents get it for free. Please, please, please take it to the dump. Yeah. We love you, Jonathan Parmavir. Yeah. Love you, Reggie. Wow! <laughs> love you, Detroit. <laughs>